This is Sean Esser, Senior Product Manager with Access Networks for Motorola. He gave a workshop today on division wave multiplexing for node segmentation. Can you give us an overview of what you talked about today? Sure. So, uh, in my uh, discussion today, I was talking about how cable operators can uh, increase uh, services such as VOD, data, and telephony uh, through the use of a tool called node segmentation. That's uh, in the uh, hybrid fiber coax space. Uh, uh, the optical nodes, uh, basically you subdivide it into smaller sections. Uh, so this can be done uh, using multiple uh, transmitters to multiple receivers in the node, but uh, standard ways of doing that it takes a lot of uh, fibers to do that. And cable operators don't have a lot of fibers uh, to, to do this. So, so what I discussed is a technique using uh, wavelength division multiplexing, which is basically taking multiple colors of light, combining it onto a single fiber, and going down to the node. And uh, there's some new techniques that uh, Motorola has come, come out with called enhanced coarse wavelength division multiplexing that enables cable operators to do that. So, so instead of laying fiber, which is very expensive, they can use this technology, use the same fiber they have today in the ground, and uh, deliver many more services to the customer. And what kind of responses are you getting from the MSO community? So a very positive response. Uh, uh, cable operators uh, have a definite need to compete with the Verizon uh, FIO system to deliver more services. And uh, so they definitely are looking for tools to increase it. And this is a great tool that they see. 